What's good, YouTube? Hey, man, I'm back at y'all with another video, another reaction video. Now, I've been asking y'all what's some stuff y'all want me to react to. Somebody told me NFL prediction video. Now, I definitely want to start doing like more sports reactions and stuff because not only they're interesting, but like, you know what I'm saying? I just feel like they some entertaining topic. And this NFL prediction video is definitely a W because as like in the breakdown, it talks about like the scores, the teams playing, like the, the star players of the teams and stuff. And I like getting into that stuff. So we're going to get into it. Y'all like, comment, subscribe before we get in this video. You know what I'm saying? Screen recording starting now. You know what I'm saying? Titans, Ravens. Yeah, let's get it. Both teams are looking to get off the schneid this week in a rematch of a shocking hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. divisional round. Before we start this video, y'all comment down below who y'all repping. Y'all already know. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Ain't got to speak on it. You hear me. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, look, y'all comment down below what team y'all is, man. Listen. The Saints, listen. I thought the Saints was going to be trash this year. I'm not even going to hold you. Saints, listen. The Saints was 4-2, and two, bro. When we lost Michael Thomas... I'm not gonna lie, I thought it was over with. But and hey, we pulled through, we 72 now. I'm ready for the next game. We play Atlanta, them Dirty Birds. Titans. I'm ready for them. But let's get Both it. Both teams are looking to get off the Schneid this week in a rematch of Derrick Henry. That's my boy. Divisional round result last season. Yeah. The hey, Derrick Henry definitely begin active. I like Derrick Henry, bro. Victory. And will do so against a Ravens defense that is coming off of a loss in which it allowed Damian Harris to rip up 121 okay. yards. Will Henry follow suit? I say yes, and Tennessee's middling rush defense will do enough to okay. force Baltimore to try to win through the air. Something they I got Tennessee winning that game. Tennessee. Don't get me wrong, though. Don't get me wrong, though. Baltimore did just pick up Dez, and Lamar Jackson has been balling, so don't get me wrong. That's going to be a good game, but I got Tennessee, bro. First in passing I got offense. Tennessee. Titans 24, Ravens 22. The Chiefs have been on a Wait, they Wait, the, they got the Titans winning 24-22. I don't think it's gonna be. I don't think it's gonna be that uh, low scoring of a game because you gotta think about it. That's two very strong offenses. Tennessee's offense is strong, and so is the, the Ravens. But I don't really know too much about Baltimore defense. I'm not sure. He, I think he was saying like they had lost or they didn't do good against New England, but they was playing in the rain though. But I definitely got the score being like 35-28. I don't. I don't know about 24-22. I don't know. Done by the Raiders in week five. Who, who playing now? An average margin oh, Chiefs and uh, Raiders. The Chiefs, the Chiefs, the Chiefs actually lost. Since the Chiefs actually lost. Welcome to the Chiefs Kingdom. This big dog right here. <laughs> He's talking that mess. To make it three and zero in road games against the Raiders. I'm boy Tyreek Hill. Lost multiple division games in a season since. That boy be moving, boy. Not about to start doing so in week eleven. Andy Reid will get a chance to take his own victory lap around brand new Allegiant Chiefs. Stadium. Even if he said it isn't his style. Shook's prediction, Chiefs 35, 35 24. Tom Brady's okay. Buccaneers are I agree with that. For a 46-point outing in week I agree 10. with that. Who Brady playing? Hold on. But they meet a formidable foe in the Rams, who own the league's second-best defense in total yardage and points allowed per game. Are they playing the Rams? Ooh, expect another offensive Ooh that's going to be a good game, boy. foresee another strong outing from Tampa Bay thanks to its third-ranked defense and second-best unit in yeah. turnovers per game. Brady will bring his primetime record what? back to even in an interstate. They got Brady with it? 27-17. 27, Rams uh, 17. I don't know, man. I don't know about that one. That's going to be a good one. Luton is not the future in Jacksonville. Before the Jaguars can move on to another candidate, they'll first have to send Luton out to face Jaguars the Jaguars Steelers. Causing defense. Um, be I mean, let me tell you this now. I think the Steelers from the bust they ass, like, let alone, like, like put to a side to what this nigga for the make his prediction. I think the Steelers from the bust they ass, like, Steelers going to score 40. I'm just going to be 100. Still is gonna go for uh they're gonna score 40. Now Jacksonville, I'm not gonna say I think I only won like one or two games. I might be wrong, I don't know, but the Steelers is undefeated. That's the only team left that did not lose, which is crazy. That uh Steelers, by the way, if y'all seen that Steelers in that Titans game, that game was crazy. They missed the field goal and they lost. That was crazy. I know the, the Titans kicker probably got his ass whooped in the locker room, but that was crazy. Um this Steelers and Jaguars game. Yeah, they finna get 40 balls. It's gonna be over back. It's gonna be over with. On Jacksonville's mistakes in what I expect to yeah, they finna get 40 balls. 30 to 6. Yeah, I think it's gonna be worse than that. They finna, the Steelers gonna score 40. 
The strength of both teams will be in week 11. And I expect to see the playing Colts and Green Bay. Aaron Rodgers will record his mm, first win against the know. number one unit in total defense in games played in week eight or later. I feel like Aaron Rodgers league best passer rating producing. Like I don't know. I feel like he can win this game. I don't think the Packers out of it though. Like History yeah, they've been losing, but the Colts is a good team. Yeah, I got the Packers winning this for sure. Against such defenses since 2010. Colts a solid team though. Colts 14. The big question in this one. Yeah, yeah. Throw it up. My got my boy. Oh, they got Jameis Winston on there. Look, listen. I told y'all, my nigga got the robot vision. We seven and two, bro. Listen, do not Saints, do not lose to these niggas, man. These niggas is like last in our division. But listen, every time we play the Falcons, these niggas always it's either a close game and we win or we lose, bro. And these niggas is not nowhere near colder than us, bro. That be making me mad, like. Breeze left off. And then Breeze not even here, so. Fully equipped to devise a game plan capable of causing I don't know. problems for opposing I'm very sure James Winston going to do an annotation. Defense has improved significantly in the last month. The Saints should still be able to ride the efforts of Alvin Kamara to a close victory. Okay, yeah. The difference yeah. here lies in New Orleans defense. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Cam Joy retarded. Six, the fewest in the NFL. New Orleans takes this one in a close 27. finish. 27. Saints 27. See, see what I'm saying? Listen. They just said they got the Saints winning 27-24. Listen, bro. The Falcons is nowhere near as good as an overall team as us, bro. But I'm telling you, this is going to be a close game. I don't know if it's going to be 27-24, but it's going to be a close game. And listen, they're going to make my nerves bad, bro, to see what they have to say. My bad. And Cleveland is well suited to win when the skies turn dark. Browns 27, Eagles 13. I wouldn't have been mad. Okay, yeah. Me neither. Yeah, I definitely the got the Browns winning. Ooh, hold on. Now, hold on. <laughs> I'm glad this came up. For all my Cowboys fans out there talking about some, oh, nye, nye, this ain't our year because that got hurt. And listen, I'm here to talk shit about the Cowboys fans. So I'm going to just let you know right now. If you're a Cowboys fan, I'm about to, yeah. Yeah. Listen. Y'all niggas, listen, bro. This is what y'all need to do, bro. I'm and I'm gonna be straight up with you. When Dak come back, listen. Get the, get him out of there. Get him out of there, bro. Y'all, listen, bro. I know Dak had that good little first year, and then now y'all say, oh, Dak is doing good and stuff. Get him out of there, bro. Listen, y'all have too many stars on y'all offense for for Dak not to throw the ball how he's supposed to, bro. Like, listen, I don't think y'all understand. You have uh uh, I'm a little slow, so I don't I don't I don't know everybody's name, but y'all have C D Lamb or C D Lamb. Y'all have uh, what's his name? Uh, Mike Gallup. Y'all have uh, but y'all got some other cold niggas. I don't know all their names, but uh, but y'all have some cold receivers. Then y'all have Zeke, bro. Y'all have too strong of an offense to not be dominated. Yes, I know y'all defense is bad. But listen, bro. Listen, y'all offense is way too strong to not be, bro. Y'all should be able to score at will, bro. Like at will, y'all, bro. Y'all offense is crazy strong. Y'all got some other receivers that I don't know off the top of my head, but crazy receivers, bro. Now the Vikings, I don't know how this is gonna play out. How y'all gonna do against the Vikings? Cause uh, like I said, I don't know too much about the Vikings, but the but the Cowboys. Boy, y'all talks a lot of shit. A lot. Dallas, where the Cowboys own the league's 31st ranked rushing defense. A week after finding a way to win against a premier unit. Feeling warm! Minnesota finds the going much And, and I will say this, bro. I do feel bad for y'all because y'all like on y'all third string quarterback. I think, really, I don't think that's a quarterback. I think that nigga's like a punter. And y'all just have to put that nigga as a quarterback. But that nigga's trash, bro. I, I get that. But listen, bro. Y'all, so Dak got hurt. He broke his leg or whatever, or his ankle. I'm not, I don't remember what it was. Then Andy Dalton got put under concussion watch because somebody had boomed his shit. Like, that nigga, I know that nigga head was ringing because I seen the play, the nigga landed on that boy. That, they, they did that bad. But listen, y'all like on y'all third string quarterback, bro. Listen to me. Y'all can still win, bro. Y'all have to let Zeke eat. Now, I know the quarterback is not the best, but listen, bro. If y'all just get these little short passes going and like these little slants or these curls or like these, just these little, you know what I'm saying? Just, 
Y'all don't gotta bomb it every play, bro. I'm not saying that, but like, bro, if y'all get the ball moving, and if Zeke doing it, screen passes to Zeke, like, bro, if the ball is moving, y'all, like I said, bro, y'all offense is way too strong, bro. Way too strong. But I do feel for y'all. Like, y'all, that nigga's trash, bro. He's trash. Rattles off its fourth straight win. Andy Dalton's return will not go as planned against a Minnesota defense that is averaging two takeaways per game since its week's Oh, wait. Is Andy, uh, so wait, is Andy Dalton coming back? I don't know. Damn, they got the Cowboys losing. I actually, I don't know. I think the Cowboys could beat the Vikings. When Andy Dalton's return will not go as planned against the Minnesota yeah, defense. Yeah, damn, 2018. Damn, they got chalked in y'all ass. Bust. I don't know. Cowboys. Like I like I said, I know the Cowboys in bad shape, but I think they'll win that game. This time, they won't need to rely on a Matt Prater field goal for the win. Y'all defense is way too strong. I mean, offense way too strong, bro. Teddy Bridgewater and on Detroit's ability to convert on third down. Oh, Teddy got hurt. I did not know that. In such scenarios, and I believe Matthew Stafford's recent improvement will be enough to help the Lions record their second win streak of the season. Mm. Something they haven't done since 2017. Lions 21. That's gonna be a good game. History I think the Panthers are gonna win that though. Young. As number two overall picks own a 14 and 7 mark against number one overall picks. They got Cincinnati and games. Washington. But I believe in Joe Burrow. Cincinnati will have. Yeah, that boy. Def hey, nah, Joe Burrow definitely been balling. I've been, been watching him. Burrow to again target fellow rookie T. Higgins plenty against Washington's league best passing defense. Higgins breaking free. Yeah, nah, that boy Burrow been doing his thing. Guys will be tight, and Cincinnati's defense will yeah, have to out. Yeah, I got the Bengals winning offense, that. Which is one of the worst units in the NFL. Bengals 20, Washington 16. I haven't picked the Jets to win all season, and that's not about to change in week 11. <laughs> <laughs> he on the Jets. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. And uh, let me tell you something. Yeah, the Jets is trash, but who? Listen, if y'all know his name, tell me his name. This nigga is cold, boy. I was watching this nigga play against the Saints, and we went in the overtime with the Chargers, I think. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we went in the overtime. This nigga's cold, bro. He a rookie, but he cold. But Los Angeles will again see it was wise in selecting the city. If y'all know who that is, put his name in the comment section. He cold, bro. Comfortable victory. The Chargers' fourth-ranked offense should shine against one of the league's worst defenses. Yeah, the Jets the Jets is over with. I don't to contribute yeah. to New York's worst total yards difference. Yeah, I got the, I got the Chargers history. beating them for sure. Chargers 27, Jets 10. Yeah. Okay, um, man, that was a good video. Um, like I said, but if y'all want me to do more videos like this, of course I'm gonna bring more and more sports videos. But I don't know exactly what y'all want. Of course I'm gonna do some uh more football stuff though, cause football is hot right now. I was thinking about doing like the basketball and stuff. I'm gonna do that probably later down the line. But football right now is getting hot. Playoffs, man. I don't know, man. Listen, tell me who y'all got in the Super Bowl, cause I'm not gonna lie. The beginning of the season. I thought it was going to be Bucks Chiefs, bro. But the Bucks been low key. I don't know. We beat the Bucks twice. The Saints beat the Bucks twice. We number one in the um in our division. I think we are because no, actually I don't know cuz the Bucks did beat the Panthers. But we beat them twice and we both 7 and 2. So I think we number one actually. But listen, man, y'all tell me who y'all got in the championship. I don't know. The Saints, listen. I ain't trying to listen, bro. I ain't trying to toot my own horn, bro. But the Saints been, listen, they defense actually been stepping up, bro. So, I don't know. But y'all comment down below who y'all team is, who y'all got. Y'all do all that game shit. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out, bro.